News 19 is your local election headquarters and today News 19 has an update for you on the fundraising efforts for the leading Republican candidate for Alabama's U.S. Senate seat. Katie Brent leads the fundraising effort, but Mike Durant's campaign is close behind. But his campaign financing paints a different picture. News 19's Greg Screws joins us now with more in the studio. Greg. Now we've seen how this race is heating up to replace U.S. Senator Richard Shelby in the primary. And both Brett and Durant have raised over $4 million. But how they got that funding is very different. So here's a look at each campaign's fundraising. The year in filings with the Federal Election Commission show that Katie Britt, a former Shelby aide who has his endorsement, reporting $4.98 million raised. Mo Brooks, the six-term congressman who has been endorsed by the former president, reports $2.1 million in contributions through the end of 2021. And Mike Durant, an aerospace executive and former U.S. Army Black Hawk pilot, reported he's raised over $4.3 million, but $4 million of that funding comes from money that he loaned to his campaign. He's raised just over $166,000 from individual donors. Now, before the end of last year, Durant turned over control of his company, Pinnacle Solutions, Inc., to his employees. Durant's been CEO of the company since 2008, and financial terms of the deal, such as the company's valuation or how much he received, were not disclosed. The company has contracts with the U.S. Navy, the Marines, NASA, and other government agencies. The Republican primary election for the U.S. Senate seat will take place on May 24th.